Hello, this is my first uh, video of play for playing cards, and uh, and I'm going to show you my collection today. A little bit about myself. I started collecting playing cards when I was seven. Uh, first deck of cards was on a flight to London, uh, Pan Am Air playing cards, and I collected as a kid for a while, then I stopped. About three months ago, I uh, went up to the attic and uh, uh, retrieved my old decks in a, in a shoe box and then I became addicted again um, you know one thing about playing cards when I was a kid was when you would fly they would sell playing cards because the only thing to do on the flights were uh, watch one movie and play cards or read books and as a kid I would buy playing cards and it was kind of like my life in playing cards you know of places I've been and now uh, I've been collecting uh, for a while and I just I just love playing cards the the diversity of them, the different designs, the artwork, um, they're just amazing. So I'm going to take you through my entire collection very quickly uh, so you don't get too bored. And in comments, uh, you know, you can talk about your collection and give me some advice on my collection and maybe give me some uh, ideas of what I should collect next. And here are just some, some basic cards here that you can see. This is Long's Drugs. I don't even think they sell those anymore. I think Long's Drugs is out of business. And uh, this is in my arcade room, so that's why you see a bunch of different stuff. Um, Casino Royale cards. Um, these cards here is from the James Bond film uh, License to Kill from um, Casino de Isthmus, uh, which is really cool. And um, there's some military cards, of course. And um, you can see those cards. There's the Casino Royale, unopened. But here are the, the Casino de Isthmus cards from License to Kill. I don't know if you can see them very good. But very cool cards. And that starred Timothy Dalton as James Bond. And that's one of my favorite decks as well. Um, the Beagles. And then uh, let's take you to the other side of my arcade room, and I'll show you my other my other cards. I got about 175 decks. A lot of them are like this. They're like plastic, which I don't like. And that's my very first deck of cards right there, which is pretty cool. And these are different places that I had visited, and it kind of goes into there a little bit. And then you see that. All these cards here are, are, are most recent. Um, Theory 11, you know, Bicycle, what have you. Yeah, very nice. These are ones I play with, opens ones I play with. And then I'll buy ones that I don't ever open. Uh, these Captain America cards are pretty cool. Um, and here are Virgin Atlantic cards. I, I bought these ooh, back in 20, 2006, and those were the last flight cards I bought. But those are very cool. And here is my glass case. You don't know if you can see it too well because of the glare, but I have uh, Monarchs. in the Bond. I love James Bond, so. And these are new, the Dune cards I picked up. Sorry for the glare. Hidden Kings cards, which are my my favorites. I just enjoy the design. I really like the colors. But the design is really what attracted me the most. Um, Copper is a great deck. Rainbow's very nice. Um, Smokey the Bear cards. I, I used to work for the California Department of Forestry, so I'm kind of, you know, embedded with uh, anything forestry. And uh, there's another Smokey the Bear deck. Uh, national Parks. And then there's a, another National Parks there. Uh, slightly different colored. Um, 
these are great cards if you can get a hold of these. Um, the courts are very cool. And check them out. You'll see what I mean. Um, maybe I'll do some kind of review on them, but they're really cool courts. And these are Pharaoh cards. I, I seem to be very much attracted to cards from the cowboy era, 1800s. Because um, that's when cards were kind of king. That's where every cowboy movie they have a scene where they're playing, you know, cards. And then I'll take you to my last case. And these are some of my favorite bicycle colors of the uh, rider back and then Odyssey which is one of my favorites uh, you want to check out the Odyssey cards as well uh, before they're gone you, you can still buy them in stores uh, very cool colors on bicycle um, the scorpion cards just because I'm a Scorpio <laughs> but the cards are really nice great design um, they come gilded as well. These beautiful cards. Um, this is this is a deck, Smoky Mountain deck by Bicycle. I love. This is a thirty-four of a thousand, and there's only a thousand made. And this one here is number thirty-three. And here are some Wrangler cards. So I'm really into the. The cowboy theme you know of of playing cards but as you can see I have loads of different variety of cards and I love to go to also antique stores and try to pick up some old cards but there's many ways to collect uh, many ways to enjoy them a lot of times my friends will come and play cards and they'll come into my arcade room and pick the deck that they want to use to play the game and they have such a variety that they just love to be able to pick whatever they want and then we go ahead and play it's pretty cool so uh, that's basically my collection and uh, you know um, the two cases really <laughs> was within a three, uh, three month period I went nuts on buying cards but I'm trying to slow down now because you know eight hundred dollars a month on cards is not is wow yeah it's crazy but uh, yeah uh, let me know what you think of this uh, small video of my collection, and uh, let's talk cards. Thanks for watching.